right, so dating 102, you got a date, now don't screw it up. Seriously. Like, see this guy, he's all about it. This chick, <laughs> she's all about it, okay? So now I'm gonna tell you how to not screw it up. All right, so now what? You got a date, all right? Do your laundry. Like, nobody wants to stink on a date. Do your laundry. Do your shirt laundry, okay? Get your hair cut, make a plan, freak out a little bit, and, okay, that was from another slide, but profit, <laughs> I mean, but, you know, but whatever, okay? Call your friends, not your single male friends. They don't know shit. Not your married male friends, because they don't know shit either. They got lazy. So, pretty much, good luck, you know, at this point. All right? Call your mom. Actually, not so much, because if you're 35, you don't have any kids, you're not married, she might be bugging you. Um, and you just really don't want to go there. All right? So, keep it moving. Come on. Come. Dang. All right, so at this point, you want to take deep breaths, refocus, and you got to figure out, you know, what does the other person like to do? <laughs> you know? Does the other person have knowledge of the date? Because, I mean, that would be pretty helpful. You know? I mean, you can try to stalk them on MySpace or Facebook, whatever. You know, so now you got to figure out what kind of a date are you going to go on? Is first date, second date, tenth date, married date, mistress date? Anyone? Anyone? Anyone here? All right. I've been on one. No, just kidding. All right. Um, so when you figure out what kind of date it is, you know, you need, to, you need to just put it all together. So one step at a time. Are you going to eat? Is it simple or classy? Are you wearing a white shirt? That guy is right there. Don't go out to an Italian joint tonight, all right? Because you get like sauce on your thing. So there you go. So you can go out and you can try to find some restaurants to go eat, eat at. So you can go to like google.com or yelp.com or urbanspoon.com. All great information. They provide you some good reviews on figuring out what you want to do as far as like just going and eating. But eating is like, I mean, or the date is more than just eating. So you need to figure out What's going on around you? Are there any local events that are going on? Concerts, um, the drunken cliff diving experiments, you gotta try it once, you know? <laughs> After the surgery, the doctor said I'd be okay. Um, you know, be unique like everyone else. Um, go to a cooking class, maybe some salsa dancing, mini golf championship tourney, those are great. Especially in fantasy football drafts, chicks love those. <laughs> Seriously, all right? So if you're still stuck, still stuck, and suck. Uh, no, just kidding, just kidding. Search the internet, uh, find some great sites out of 1995. I shit you not. Go to like date ideas, like a keyword. You'll find some seriously sick sites. You know, they got like the marquee tag <laughs> going on. So anyways, wait for it. No, I'm not selling anything. I'm not selling Amway or Mary Kay. I don't have the pink Cadillac uh, or some random fruit juice that's guaranteeing to cleanse your soul and prevent erectile dysfunction. Um, so there is a better way. So you got a date, you got your laundry done, you got your hair did, all right? You get, you're feeling a, little, feeling a little saucy, all right? So then you're like, okay, so now what do I do? Come on, Andrew. <laughs> <laughs> Bam! Datedesigner.com. Uh, this is my little site that I created. Um, you can basically go and you can search for local-based date ideas. So you can search for romantic dates. Um, this has since been gone. You can now, like, it's free form, like, location search. Um, and then you can go and you can search for the dates. You get a description of the dates. You get the places to go on on the dates. You even get a little map, some reviews. I mean, it's real helpful for anybody that's literally got no idea of what to do. <laughs> okay? So, and then the other edge, the other end of the site is that you can build dates and share them with everybody else because it's a very community driven site. So you can go here and you can search for venues to add and you can select, select them and it adds them to your little date plan and then you can save them and you can share them with the world. So be a champ, close the deal. Always got to close the deal. Remember that. Okay? You got everything you need. Get your butt on the date. Make eye time. Don't stare at the boobs. Chicks don't like that. Seriously. <laughs> I mean some chicks do but that's not the one you want to be taking on a date. So. <laughs> Anyways, I'm Bo Frazetta. I'm the chief date designer and developer. Uh, that's my blog. Uh, Brent Spohr, I bought a Mac, is my designer. And Gangplank Headquarters uh, pretty much provides me with everything else. They were, uh, I was an incubated company out of there, out of Phoenix. Uh, so one more info, talk to me after. Uh, email me, search keyword Bo on Google. I recently hit page one for keyword Bo. Um, send me a message in a bottle. I really like that, especially if it's like some chicks, you know. <laughs> so anyways. Thank you.